Imagine a telescope so powerful it can peer across the universe, traveling back in time billions of years to capture the first moments after the Big Bang. Imagine a device so sensitive it can detect hints of water on distant planets or study mysterious dark matter, the elusive stuff that makes up most of our universe but remains hidden. This isn't science fiction, it's the James Webb Space Telescope, NASA's latest and most advanced space probe. Since its launch in December 2021, JWST has been revealing breathtaking discoveries, answering age-old questions, and sparking new ones. What secrets is this eye in the sky uncovering about our galaxy, neighboring planets, and even the possibility of extraterrestrial life? Stay with us because in this video we'll explore how the James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST, is completely transforming our understanding of space. We'll dive into everything from the telescope's revolutionary design and its journey to some of the first stunning images it's sent back, painting an awe-inspiring picture of our universe. The James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST, is a marvel of engineering designed to be the most advanced telescope ever launched. It's a project decades in the making, and it's NASA's follow-up to the beloved Hubble telescope. JWST was launched in December 2021, taking nearly 30 years of development to reach this milestone. As the successor to Hubble, JWST was specifically crafted to push our understanding of space even further. As NASA says, JWST is the telescope that will unlock the secrets of the universe. Its discoveries have already stunned the world and made scientists excited for what's yet to come. Revolutionary Infrared Capabilities Unlike Hubble, which mostly uses visible light, JWST primarily uses infrared. This shift is game-changing because infrared light can travel through cosmic dust clouds that block visible light, allowing JWST to reveal previously hidden parts of the cosmos. Think of it like switching on a night vision camera. It uncovers things that were right there all along, just hidden from our sight. This ability is why astronomers often call JWST the world's ultimate time machine, because it's letting us see ancient galaxies and stars in ways we couldn't before engineering feat a giant in space with its 21-foot gold-plated mirror, JWST's design is a feat in itself. This massive mirror is over two and a half times the size of Hubble's and is made up of 18 hexagonal segments that work together to create a single, unified surface. It's stationed at Lagrange Point 2, about a million miles from Earth, where it has a stable orbit for capturing images without interference from our planet. According to NASA engineers, JWST is the most intricate and powerful space observatory ever created, and it's only just begun its journey. The unveiling of the first JWST images global excitement when NASA released the first images from JWST in July 2022, the world was absolutely stunned. These images weren't just beautiful, they represented the deepest infrared views of the universe ever captured. Everyone, from professional astronomers to space enthusiasts, was buzzing with excitement. It's like we've opened a new window into the cosmos, one scientist said. This anticipation isn't surprising, given that JWST's abilities far surpass those of any telescope before it, creating a sense of wonder about what else it might reveal. Visual Comparisons with Hubble to grasp just how advanced JWST is, consider how it compares to Hubble. Side-by-side -side comparisons show an incredible level of detail JWST captures that Hubble could only hint at. Its images bring out colors, structures, and finer elements within galaxies that were never visible before. One astronomer described it as going from black and white television to ultra high definition color. These new images are revealing entire clusters and intricate cosmic webs that had remained invisible to us, opening up parts of the universe we never knew existed. Second anniversary and what we're seeing in this image of the penguin and the egg are two galaxies that are not only interacting, they are on a path to merge and become one bigger galaxy. Uh, the, the redder or orangey one, the penguin, um, there's, that's a spiral galaxy like our own Milky Way, except the arms have been twisted and warped by the gravity of the companion. This is a really common way that galaxies grow over time. Our own Milky Way has merged with other galaxies, and in a couple giga years, it's going to, a billion years, it's going to merge with the Andromeda galaxy. So by studying images like this, we can understand that process in the, the life cycle of galaxies like the Milky Way. So interesting, the life cycles uh, and seeing these two merge to form another galaxy. Uh, when, we, when we think about the James Webb, we have to, of course, give proper respect to the Hubble telescope because it was revolutionary for its time. And I actually want to put up a side by side where you can take a look at what the James Webb telescope has shown us in comparison mm -hmm. to what we saw from Hubble. And it really is incredible, the depths of detail. Talk to us about some of the most important findings that the Webb telescope has discovered since the images were first released. 
Sure, and I love in that that that, it, that side by side in web you're seeing through the dust. You're actually seeing through our own galaxy to see the other side of our galaxy and then then past it. Um, as far as the biggest results to date, and we're two years in, our our best results are are coming in a mile a minute. I would say the, that we. It's really important to me that we did exactly what we said we would do to, uh, to just figure out what did the early universe look like? What was that first billion years like after the Big Bang? The first images from JWST didn't just look impressive. They provided scientists with groundbreaking data on galactic structures, the behavior of gas clouds, and star formations. This early glimpse gave us a closer look at the interactions between stars and gas clouds, as well as the faint connections between galaxy clusters. These images are already challenging existing theories and advanced Enhancing our understanding of how the universe formed and evolved. As one scientist put it, each image is a puzzle piece in the vast picture of cosmic history. Looking back to the formation of the universe. JWST's advanced sensitivity allows it to capture light from galaxies formed just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. It's like having a time machine, giving us a view of the universe as it was billions of years ago. By looking at these early galaxies, scientists can study what the universe looked like in its infancy. This insight has been described as a snapshot of the universe's baby pictures, and it's helping us learn how galaxies and other structures came into being. The telescope has also been able to detect elements like hydrogen and helium in these early galaxies, tracing the formation of the basic building blocks that make up every Everything. It's astonishing to think that JWST can pick up light from stars and galaxies that burned billions of years ago. One scientist noted, these elements tell the story of everything, from stars to planets to us. By tracing these elements, JWST is helping scientists understand how everything, including life, came to be. JWST may finally help us locate Population 3 stars, the very first stars formed after the Big Bang. These stars are theorized to be composed solely of hydrogen and helium and have remained mysterious for years. Discovering them would be groundbreaking for understanding the Earth early stages of the universe. One scientist stated, if we find population three stars, it will be like discovering the first chapter of a cosmic book we never knew existed. Discoveries around exoplanets and potential habitability atmospheric composition analysis. The James Webb Space Telescope has a unique ability to analyze exoplanet atmospheres. Using infrared light, JWST detects gases like water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane, compounds often tied to life processes. This capability allows scientists to look for potential biosignatures and assess whether certain planets could support life. As one researcher put it, JWST is like a cosmic detective sniffing out signs of life from light years away. For those curious about the search for life beyond Earth, JWST's findings in exoplanet atmospheres are incredibly promising. Tonight, we're looking into posts being spread on social media. They claim the James Webb Space Telescope spotted a large object about 10 light years away moving toward Earth. The posts claim that the telescope captured the object changing its trajectory in an unnatural manner, meaning it must be some sort of extraterrestrial life. But there is currently no evidence of this. The website Snopes did a major fact check, and the only sources of information on the object are UFO and alien content creators. There hasn't been any official word on it from NASA, other space agencies, or any branch of Congress. Biosignature Exploration JWST's powerful instruments allow scientists to study exoplanets in the habitable zone, areas where temperatures might allow liquid water, essential for life. Detecting biosignatures or chemicals indicating life on distant planets brings us closer to answering the age-old question, are we alone in the universe? By finding such markers, scientists hope to identify worlds that might harbor life, raising the tantalizing possibility of life beyond our solar system. With each discovery, JWST nudges us closer to what might be the biggest discovery in human history notable exoplanet observations among JWST's first targets was WASP-96b, an exoplanet located 1,150 light-years away. JWST's data revealed an incredibly detailed atmospheric profile for this planet, offering more clarity than ever before. As one scientist explained, JWST has turned what used to be blurry sketches into HD photos. Each new exoplanet observation provides us with invaluable insights into these distant worlds, potentially setting the stage for even more profound discoveries about life in the universe. The Mysterious Dark Matter Observations one of JWST's groundbreaking roles is using gravitational lensing to indirectly map dark matter in the universe. 
gravitational lensing lets scientists study how massive objects bend light, revealing the distribution of invisible matter. Dark matter, which makes up most of the universe's mass, is one of astronomy's biggest puzzles. With JWST's help, we're starting to get a clearer picture of where this mysterious matter exists, pushing science closer to cracking the dark matter code. Dark energy, believed to drive the accelerated expansion of the universe, is another enigma JWST is helping to explore. By observing how galaxies and galaxy clusters move, JWST offers insights into the nature and influence of dark energy. The data gathered could have major implications for our understanding of universal expansion. As an astrophysicist remarked, it's like watching the universe breathe. JWST's contributions might just help demystify dark energy's role in shaping our cosmos. JWST's findings challenge existing dark matter theories, offering new details about its behavior and potential composition. While scientists once only theorized about dark matter's influence, JWST's observations provide hard data, setting the stage for new models and discoveries. It's an era of potential breakthroughs. As one expert noted, we may be on the edge of discovering what makes up the invisible structure of our universe. Insights into star formation and life cycles. Studying stellar nurseries, using its infrared capabilities, JWST provides detailed views of stellar nurseries, dense clouds where stars are born. JWST's observations allow scientists to witness star formation in real time, exploring the early stages of these celestial objects. Every star has a beginning, and JWST is giving us a front row seat, says one astronomer. By observing these stellar nurseries, we gain new insights into the cycles that drive cosmic evolution, formation of solar systems. In these star-forming regions, JWST observes protoplanetary disks of gas and dust around young stars, the raw materials for creating solar systems. By studying this process, scientists can learn how planets, moons, and other celestial objects form, shedding light on the origins of systems like our own. This aspect of JWST's mission connects us to the cosmic story of formation and growth, revealing the roots of planetary systems. Observing dying stars and supernovae, JWST also captures stars in their dying phases, from red giants to supernovae. Watching these stars release elements like carbon and oxygen into space highlights the cosmic recycling that sustains life. These dying stars essentially seed the universe with elements crucial for life as we know it. As Carl Sagan famously said, we are made of star stuff, and JWST's findings bring this sentiment to life. New discoveries in our solar system. While JWST is built to explore distant space, it also provides unprecedented detail on objects closer to home, like asteroids and comets. Its infrared sensitivity reveals information on their composition and orbit. For example, JWST has observed asteroid belts and comet tails with incredible detail, offering insights into the materials that once formed planets. Studying these objects gives scientists a window into the early solar system and our own origins. The James Webb Telescope detected a possible sign of life on this very faraway planet, K218b. Here's the real talk on what's happening and why scientists are hesitantly excited about this. Okay, so the James Webb Telescope can detect what kinds of light pass through faraway planets atmospheres, and then we can see what part of the light spectrum gets blocked, indicating that it was absorbed by a certain chemical. Scientists think this time it may have detected dimethyl sulfide, or DMS, which here on Earth is only produced by living things, like phytoplankton in our oceans. The telescope also seems to have found methane and CO2 in the planet's atmosphere, meaning that the planet could have a liquid water ocean. But these are tentative results. We need more data to confirm. It would obviously be huge and very exciting if we confirmed these signs of life, but it's already exciting that the James Webb Telescope can detect what's on a planet that far away in the first place. Researchers say that it'll be about a year until we can collect enough data to check these results. And you better bet I'm going to be following up. If you like optimistic science and tech stories, follow for more. JWST's high-resolution images of Jupiter reveal breathtaking details about its auroras, magnetic field, and weather patterns. These images capture storms larger than Earth and showcase the planet's swirling atmosphere. As one astronomer puts it, JWST is seeing Jupiter as we've never seen it before. The data from Jupiter's atmosphere atmosphere helps scientists understand gas giants better, impacting theories about similar planets throughout the universe. Beyond Jupiter, JWST will continue studying gas giants, including Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Observing these distant planets in detail can give scientists a better understanding of their atmospheres, magnetic fields, and even ring systems. By revealing more about these complex giants, JWST is setting the stage for future exploration of planetary formation and evolution within our own solar system, mapping the chemistry of the cosmos.
JWST spectrometers allow scientists to study the chemical composition of stars and galaxies in unprecedented detail. By identifying elements like carbon, nitrogen, and oxygen, JWST maps out the building blocks of life across the universe. These discoveries help scientists understand how elements that make up everything, from planets to humans, are distributed and interact across the cosmos. JWST's data has already located complex organic molecules in star-forming regions, sparking hope for life-friendly environments elsewhere. These elements, like carbon and nitrogen, are essential for life, so finding them far from Earth is a thrilling possibility. As one researcher said, the more building blocks of life we find, the more we believe life might not be unique to Earth. JWST's findings deepen our understanding of the universe's habitability. JWST's ability to identify organic compounds extends beyond distant galaxies to star systems forming new planets. Discovering such molecules in star-forming regions hints at the potential for life-friendly chemistry elsewhere. These discoveries are key to understanding the potential for life across the cosmos, and JWST's findings findings have reignited interest in life's chemical foundation, exploring the origins of black holes. JWST has detected light emitted from matter around supermassive black holes in distant galaxies, offering a window into how these cosmic giants form. Observing the regions around black holes provides clues about the early universe's energetic processes. The telescope's data suggests black holes had an enormous role in shaping galaxies, and understanding this role is essential for unraveling cosmic history. JWST's observations support theories that black holes may have formed shortly after the Big Bang, influencing galaxy development. Black holes have always been among the most mysterious objects in space, and with JWST, scientists are beginning to piece together their role in the universe. It's as if JWST has lifted a veil on black holes, allowing us to study them as never before. Black holes and galaxies appear to evolve together, with black holes playing an active role in galaxy formation and structure. By studying these relationships, JWST adds a new layer of understanding to how galaxies, stars, and cosmic structures formed and evolved. Each observation brings us closer to understanding the impact black holes have had on shaping the universe as we know it. The search for interstellar or water. Discovery of water signatures in space JWST has already detected water vapor in interstellar clouds and exoplanet atmospheres, a discovery that raises exciting questions. Water is essential to life, so finding it elsewhere in the cosmos increases the possibility of life-supporting conditions. As Carl Sagan once said, where there is water, there could be life, and JWST is helping us discover where water is most abundant in the universe. The discovery of water-rich environments in interstellar space provides a foundation for theories about life beyond Earth. Whether it's on distant planets, planets, or in star-forming regions, these water signatures suggest that the conditions for life may not be as rare as we once thought. JWST's findings are giving us more confidence that life might exist beyond Earth, raising profound questions about our place in the universe. JWST's observations indicate that water could be common in areas where stars and planets are forming. This discovery has profound implications for the possibility of water-rich exoplanets and even habitable worlds. Finding water in these regions supports the idea that water, and potentially life, is more common throughout the universe than we ever believed, probing the edge of the known universe. JWST has captured images of galaxies at the very edge of the observable universe, revealing parts of space we've never seen before. Observing these galaxies offers scientists a glimpse into the farthest reaches of our universe, sparking questions about what lies beyond. For some, these observations inspire thoughts about cosmic edges and boundaries, questioning if the universe has a limit. JWST's observations raise questions about the edge of the universe, challenging our ideas of infinity and cosmic boundaries. If there is a boundary, what lies beyond it? Each image captured by JWST inspires inspires new questions about the size and shape of the cosmos, pushing the limits of human understanding. We're peering into the unknown, says one astronomer, and it's breathtaking. With every JWST observation, we inch closer to exploring theories like the multiverse, which suggests multiple universes beyond our own. If JWST continues to capture unexpected phenomena, we may someday confirm the existence of alternate realities or universes. Such a discovery would fundamentally reshape our understanding of reality, making JWST's findings truly groundbreaking. Potential signs of life in space. Searching for biosignatures, JWST is actively searching for biosignatures, chemical traces like oxygen and methane, in the atmospheres of distant planets. Finding these chemicals would hint at life-sustaining conditions and could represent the first evidence of extraterrestrial life. This search is about more than just science. It's a quest to answer one of humanity's oldest questions. Are we alone? Finding organic molecules, JWST's sensitivity allows it to detect organic molecules in interstellar space, the building blocks of life. These findings suggest that life-friendly environments could be more widely 
widespread than we thought. Discovering such molecules inspires hope that the universe might be teeming with simple life forms, hidden in star-forming regions and exoplanets alike. If JWST finds signs of life, it would be one of the most transformative discoveries in human history. Not only would it change our understanding of biology and the cosmos, but it would also have profound philosophical and cultural implications. As one scientist put it, discovering life beyond Earth would change everything we know about life itself. The James Webb Space Telescope is rewriting our understanding of the universe, one discovery at a time. From glimpses of the universe's early days to potential signs of life beyond Earth, JWST is opening our eyes to cosmic wonders we never thought possible. What do you think JWST will discover next? Could it find life out there or reveal even more mysteries about our cosmic origins? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and if you want to keep up with the latest in space exploration, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the unknown.